welcoming you to Step Into the Valley with the Three Step Realty Group. Now today, we're gonna talk about the COVID-19 Economic Relief Package that was signed on March 27th. And right now, we're not recording where we normally do, we're actually in my home because we're shelter in place. So I still wanted to get you some updated information. And some of you may not have heard about the details or how they might this package might benefit you. So I wanna start with homeowners. If you have a government-backed mortgage, so by Fannie Mae, uh, Freddie Mac, HUD, uh, VA loan or USDA loan, then you could request a payment forbearance up to 360 days. Now, if that gets approved, oh, by the way, you don't have to prove any hardship for that either. And if that gets approved, then it comes with no additional fees and there should also be no interest or penalty charges for that. If you do have a mortgage that is government backed, call your mortgage provider, call the person you write your mortgage payments to, to see if you could qualify for a forbearance for what's going on today. Now, for renters, talk to your landlords, talk to your property management uh, person or people to see if there are any provisions that are being made for you through their company or through the homeowner. Um, now, on to student loans. For people with federal student loans, those payments can be suspended for up to six months with no interest accrual. So you're not gonna owe more for having those payments paused. Now, here's the one that I wanna go into more detail with you, and these are the tax credits. So people, this is for the stimulus package that was approved that people have heard mostly about is that the government is giving up to $1,200 to people who have filed their tax returns as single that make under $7,500, $75,000, um, and up to $2,400 for people who have filed their tax returns joint and make under $150,000. If you have filed as head of household, then it would be if you've made under $112,500. Now, if you have a child who is under 17 and qualifies, you will also get $500 per child. What I'd like to emphasize here is this isn't just money they're giving you, this is called a tax credit or rebate, if you will. So make sure you're looking at these details. If you have filed your tax returns electronically, then you will receive payment electronically deposited into your bank account. If not, you will get a check in the mail if you qualify. Now, I'd also like to point out that there is a max. It does phase out at one point, meaning if you are a single person with no qualifying children and you make over $99,000, then you will not qualify for this tax credit. If you are a couple filing jointly with no qualifying children um, and you make over $198,000, you will not qualify. So what that means is it starts at $75,000 for $1,200 for a person filing singly, single, and it will be adjusted per your income. And that income is gonna be based off of your 2019 tax returns that you filed. If you have not filed those tax returns yet, they will base it off of the income on your 2018 tax returns. So take a look at these. These are things that may be able to help you while we are shelter in place and if you cannot work. In the meantime, stay tuned, subscribe to our, our YouTube channel here because we're gonna provide information every Friday, a new video for you. We'll see you then.